Good afternoon, YouTube. I hope to find everyone doing well today. I have a wonderful recipe for you today. We're going to get right into the video. Guys, you are going to need some cheese for this recipe. And I chose two different types of cheese. And you are gonna need some toothpicks for this recipe, some sour cream. You are gonna need lots of lettuce for this recipe, tomato, a tomato. You are gonna need some hamburger meat for the recipe. And also we have our taco season. You're gonna need this for the recipe. Um, the tacos is for my family that don't like, um, I am making some uh, wraps today, lettuce wraps, and I love them, guys. Wonderful flavor, but my family don't seem to like them, so I'm going to make um, some tacos for them, so I just set that aside, um, and we're going to get right into this recipe, guys. Okay, guys, I got my skillet going over here. And this is a cast iron skillet, guys. So what I like to do is keep my cast iron skillet. I keep it oiled all the time. Um, so that's why you see the oil in here, guys. So I'm going to let this get hot. And we are going to add our hamburger, ground beef, into the pan for our lettuce wrap and our tacos. So we're gonna start putting that hamburger meat, guys, in that skillet, guys. Okay, guys, we got our ground beef into the skillet, and it's going. So let's give it a stir, guys. Let's kind of break it up a little bit, guys. And just let that brown be just brown. So we are going to add a little salt and accent to this recipe. And we're just going to let that cook, guys, before we put our taco season into our recipe. Okay, guys, now we are going to add well, some onions, white onions, in this recipe, guys. If you guys watch my videos, you know that when I make tacos, I put onions in them. Kind of work up. It, it works up that flavor a little bit. But I love the taco season from Taco Bell. That's my favorite season for cooking my tacos guys so we just gonna let that cook for about three or four minutes and then we are gonna add our taco season into the recipe guys kitchen smell wonderful guys
So we got our ground beef cooking up, guys. Make sure you kind of break that beef up a little bit, guys. Okay, guys, now we are going to add our taco seasoning to the recipe, guys. Now, in this container, guys, I mixed a little water, and I mixed my seasoned mix. And we're going to add this to the recipe. Don't put a lot of water in the recipe, guys. Okay, so guys, you added a cup of, I think that was like a, a cup of water, a half a cup of water, and your season. We're just going to let it cook. Mix well, though. And then you are going to let this recipe simmer for about 10, 15 minutes. And then we'll be able to put the recipe together, guys. And I'll be able to let you see how this recipe come out. But you're going to have to let this ground beef cook and mix well. So your onions and your salt and your accent and your taco season. Mix well, guys, and just let it cook. Oh boy, that smells so good, guys. You're gonna love this recipe. Okay, guys, stir. It's almost done, guys. Then we'll be able to put our recipe together, guys. I see it's sticking a little bit, guys. So I think we're going to have to put a little water in this recipe. Be careful with the water, guys. Not a lot. Because you want this to cook all the way down, guys. Okay, guys, so almost there. And then we're going to put our wrap together. Now, guys, this was my one of my very first jobs. When I was about 16, I used to work at Taco Bell. Maybe that's why I don't like to go to the restaurant and order off the menu and get nothing to eat there. I just don't like the, I don't care for the meat. But I do buy the products off the marketplace. Guys, just let that cook down. You see all that grease in there, guys? We're going to have to dip that out. Always dip that grease out, guys, before you serve it to your family, okay? This ground beef that I bought, it wasn't um, a good beef, but we're going to make it taste good, okay? guys okay guys this is a lot of grease so you don't want to serve that so you're gonna have to dip it out guys now if you get some ground beef that is a bad batch and it got a lot of fat in it just dip it out just like this guys 
You don't want to serve that grease to your family, okay? Okay, moving along, guys. We are going to... See, that's much better, guys. You got all that, that fat out of there. So now we're going to move on to the putting this recipe together. I'm going to let you see how it came out. See you on another video, guys. Have a wonderful weekend. It's beautiful in the state of Michigan. It's about 80 degrees today. Okay, we're going to get right into putting these wraps together, guys. So we're going to add our meat. And try to get you the biggest piece of lettuce you can get. I went to two marketplaces to find some lettuce. But I didn't find what I want because I wanted the biggest one, but they didn't have really huge lettuce. Sometimes you could run up on um, a pack of lettuce and it'd be, they'd be big. So as you can see, I put my meat on to my lettuce. And I put the cheese on there because I like my cheese to melt. So I put that cheese on there first. So now we are going to take, and we're going to add us a tomato. Going to our lettuce. And we're going to add some sour cream. You don't want to eat this recipe without some sour cream, guys. So add some sour cream to the recipe as much as you want. I love sour cream, guys. So, I got my, still using the taco sauce, I am going to use my avocado hot sauce, guys. So, we're going to add a little on there. Oh, this is so good, guys. So you're talking about something really good. You got to try it, guys. So then after you put your wrap together, you are gonna take you some toothpick, guys. Cause you, want it, you don't want it to fall apart on you, so we're gonna stick it together. So we're gonna stick it together, just like that. And then I got some ground beef left for my family to make them happy. Cause they don't like the wraps, but I love them. Oh, is it, these wraps are so good. All right, guys. So there you go. Mmm. And this is our avocado wraps, guys. Well, let's just take the toothpicks out, guys, so you can see it. See that sour cream and that avocado all mixed up together. Oh boy, I love it. Mmm, really, really good, guys. Y'all have a wonderful weekend. Enjoy yourself. Take care of yourself. Be good to yourself and don't forget to be good to others. And I'll see you on the next video, my friends.